These foam pumpkins are lots of fun to make and give students lots of room for creativity. Plus, they light up. For this activity, you'll need a small foam pumpkin. It doesn't matter if it's hollow or not. A pair of plastic vampire teeth and an electric tea light. For carving, you can use a pumpkin carving saw that they sell in kits. You can use a canary cutter meant for cardboard, or you can use an X-Acto knife or box cutter if you feel safe doing so. Hold the teeth against the pumpkin and trace an outline. Use your knife or saw to cut a hole that's deep enough for the teeth to fit all the way inside the pumpkin. Put the tip of a pencil centered in the hole for your teeth and push it through the pumpkin out the other side. This will help you align your light. Place the bulb of the tea light into the hole created by the pencil. Trace around the tea light. Then use your saw or knife to cut a hole for the tea light. Again, making sure it's deep enough to push the tea light all the way into the pumpkin and for the light to come out by the teeth. Test the placement of your light and your teeth to make sure you get the effect you want. You may want to paint the inside of the pumpkin before gluing the teeth into place. Then get out the craft supplies and googly eyes and decorate your pumpkin. You can give it whatever kind of a character you like. Flip the switch on the tea light and your pumpkin will light up, making a spooky decoration for Halloween. Get creative and share your pumpkins with friends.